Becca fans, it's me, Becca, and I'm here with Sandra. And if you're just now joining us, well, I named Sandra after the Sandra Bullock because why not? She's like the greatest actress that ever lived. I mean, have you seen The Blind Side? And fun fact, The Blind Side was filmed in Atlanta. ATL with Betches, what's up? Anyways, sorry I haven't been posting recently. I've been super busy. I got this really cool job at an office. I've been there for about two months now. And the women there won't let me into their little friend circle, so. I've been spending a lot of time hanging out with the guys there. What can I say about them? They're morons. And honestly, I'm surprised they don't all live at home in their mom's basements and she's still not wiping their butts for them because they're so stupid. You know, all I want is to come into work and just have an intelligent conversation with a fellow female. You know, is that too much to ask? And instead, I'm standing around with a bunch of dum-dums talking about if I had balls, which one would itch more if I wore boxers or briefs? I don't have balls, I don't know. All the while I stand there and watch Mia and Natasha talk about what they did last night and how great a time they had at the bar when Ashley the bartender and had Amarino Sours. It's like, you know, why not me? Like, I'm cool too. Why would you not want to hang out with me? So that's where we are in life. I'm not usually this hot mess, but I started today off on the wrong foot. <sighs> it's just another Monday where Mia bitches and Natasha bitches. <sighs> They're such whores. We've all been through it. Everyone has felt the loss, and it's unfair. Good morning. So Thank God. Oh, no, it's fine. I was just in the middle of my pitch. Of course, don't mind me. Look, Jared, we need to mind you, okay? Because this is the fifth time you've been late to a pitch but meeting. But there are no clients here. I don't care if no one is here. You are not to be late to a pitch meeting ever. If no one is here, then there wouldn't be a meeting. Natasha, that means no one will be in the building. You wouldn't be in the building. Am I crazy? Am I, what? I can't. I have to dumb explain everything for Natasha. Just things that, like, I shouldn't have to explain. You know, like, no, Natasha, you can't microwave aluminum foil. That's dangerous. Like, I don't know. I'm sorry. My boss is an idiot. Why is she getting paid five times I'm getting paid? Because her boss is an idiot. Because everyone that I work for is an idiot. Mia, please continue. Well, I have to start from the beginning because coffee arrived. And Mia does this shake thing that drives me insane. <laughs> You know, she thinks she's like this huge marketing genius and that she knows everything. Well, I'm the one that has a degree in human behavior. So I literally know everything yet and you literally know nothing. <laughs> I'm not usually this hot mess, but I started today off on the wrong foot. We've all been through it. Everyone has felt the loss and it's unfair to both individuals and to all of America. No one deserves to feel the unbalance of wearing mismatched socks. <laughs> mismatched socks? Yeah, because the other one always goes missing. We see Taylor having a horrible day, catching the bus late, spilling his coffee, and feeling frustrated. Then it's revealed a sock was missing the entire time. But Taylor will never have to endure this frustration ever again because Sock City now sells three socks in a pair. Boom. I don't like the model. Taylor has chicken legs. Since I was homeschooled for most of my life, I've dedicated the rest of my life to judging and analyzing people. I'm basically the most valuable employee at this agency. First of all, it is a scientific fact that people do well with something that they can relate to. They like curvier models, so I don't think we should count Taylor out yet. Yeah, but not too curvy, okay? Wow, That's distracting. But uh, what about my pitch? He's a man. <laughs> Tell me what you think. Zach? Zach. Huh? Oh, yeah, look, Mike's. Great. Um, okay, look, let's just stay focused here, okay? We need a model with more substance because I don't think that our client is going to be happy with skinny, hairy little legs. I like a natural man. Well, most of America doesn't, okay? So you'll learn soon enough. Just trust me, can we get this done before next week? Sure.
Okay, I want to talk about our social media campaign for the Kelvin's Bowties ad. So if you guys will open your folders, you guys each have some demo pics from the shoot we did last week with the model. So yes, congratulations are in order. His signature look has become increasingly popular. I think that we definitely should capitalize from this. So any ideas how we would do that? Yeah, good. Oh, great. Touch with Bob's ties and see if they're interested in making him the news for their campaign. Okay, cool. Yeah, just email that to me later. Great. So I think we're done here. Yeah, I think that's yeah. You're so stupid! All the time! Everything they do! No one, mom! I heard you talking to someone. Okay, mom, I'm talking to my millions of followers. You can't just interrupt me. I'm in the middle of a vlog right now. Do you remember the line? 